welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video, you golf life legends. I'm here with the main man, Ollie Pope, England vice captain, and we're gonna go through his bag. And this is just before you're gonna go out with uh, Timmy Bullard and have a little uh, little match. Yeah, take Nervous, it. looking forward to it? Yeah, looking forward to it. He's a solid golfer, so might need a couple shots, but it should be good. Love that. Right, well, normally I start at the top and work down, but I wanna talk about these head covers. Yeah. So we're still, we, we, we go with last with them, so let's work from the bottom and go up. What's your, what's your irons, mate? What's your, what's your set up? I've got, so I've got the wedges 50, 54, 50. I've got these Callaways. These are... Uh, oh, the jaws raw, okay. Jaws raw and then... And are these a standard set up or have you, standard um, setup, have you got them yeah, fitted for you? Yeah, they're, they're slightly, they try and take a little bit of spin. I've got them fitted, yeah. Right, okay. Just helping me with taking a little bit of spin off. Us cricketers are quite steep, so... Yeah. If there's a bit of wind, it just goes straight up. And does that sort of favour a... A slice with, with the sort of that the cricket yeah, technique. It, the cricket technique does so. Yeah. The, my clubs generally set up to try and, especially the the longer yeah. the longer clubs are trying to stop me from slicing it, which is uh, sometimes a good thing, sometimes yeah. a bad thing. But so I got them, and then I love that. Yeah. So, so you've gone from pitch and wedge through to wedge a four, is it? Through to a four iron, yeah. And what have you got, got for five, them? So I've got the apex, uh, and oh, apex these blades. are pretty new actually. Um, is there a cavity in there, or is it? Are they full out blades? Full out. Oh, okay. They're, but they're being. I love these clubs. They. Um, I think my long irons are probably my strong point in right. the game. So these and it's, are. It's worth mentioning you're off three. Three, yeah, off three. So yeah, double yeah. decent golfer, which we'll see on Sunday. So these are these are great. Uh, loving them. Um, trying to just, and then I've got my, then I've got my woods, I've got my, I like this thing actually, it goes, it goes nice, it goes about 240, 250. So what we've got, you've got, you've got the, so vent, you've got the like venus a, in there. Yeah. You, you love it, it, I love it that. It was either that or a two iron, um, but I really enjoy this actually. See quite so. a lot of, quite a lot of low single figure handicaps Have are going to these, aren't they? They're, oh, they're, yeah. they're moving on to these, because like we were speaking to Radar the other day. Yeah. Like they're much more forgiving. What, what, so you've got a 20, 20 degree, so forgiving. three iron replacement. And again, takes a bit of spin off, so right. quite hard to stop it from trying to hit a long green, but. And that's the Callaway Apex as well, Callaway so there's, a, there's a theme there, isn't there? Yeah, yeah. You're, you're, then, run, you're running through. And then to be honest, probably my least used club is the, I've got the two Paradigms now, so this wood, this three wood, which is Callaways. a great club, but I just need to, these are pretty new actually, I've had yeah. them probably, probably only used them for about a month or so. Because you were saying off camera, weren't you? Obviously you had your shoulder injury, shoulder just, injury. just come back. So you, oh. got them, you got them fresh out of the box. I had and the then fitting, yeah, I had the fitting. You looked at them in your, in injured, your front room for about, the week yeah. after, man. I'm just staring at them thinking, can yeah. I, can I? Yeah. But no, this is, uh, I need to spend a bit of time on, probably the two the two longest clubs, this three wood and the driver. Uh, but I'm not really a range man. I'm not, I don't no. spend enough time on the range. I mean, range. let's be honest, most of the golf life. Yeah, aren't. yeah, exactly. You want to go out on the course just and play, right? just want to go out and play. Um, and then obviously- Before this we get to that, high, talk, yeah, talk yeah. about this. Yeah. Where are, they, where are these from? They're awesome head these covers. Are, I think these are actually from the Grove. Right. I've actually just lost this one, funny yeah. enough. Classic. Classic, How yeah. many have you done, bruv? About four head covers of these? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so I just try and keep it varied. And then this one, this one's a quite good, a new one actually. Good vibes only. Well, yeah, it kind of reminds me if I'm ever playing bad. We'll get a close up a bit, but I'll show you that for now. Look, look at that. If I'm ever playing bad, look down at that and think, CMC come on. CMC design. It's just my goal. They are awesome. Right, while it's out, let's yeah. get it out. And then Paradigm, yeah. Which so how, the, how's this set up for you then? What have you got, like nine, nine degrees standard? So basically sets up so I try and stop slicing it. Right, okay. Because I'm a bit of, what we were I saying think, about, yeah, yeah, before. So I spoke to the guys there and it comes out quite low. It's only nine degrees, comes out quite low. And into the wind, this is when it's great. It's in, yeah. If it's on a gusty day, yeah. straight into the wind and it just stays a little bit below it. Okay. And, what, and what did you have before the Paradigm? Was it still Callaway? Uh, no, I wasn't actually for my sins. But yeah. No. Um, so this, this is, this is the one but for this you This is now. great, yeah. yeah. I just need to, again, these two clubs need to probably go to the range and just yeah. give, them, give them 100 balls each. Right, okay. And then just find something because... And I will, I'm sure. I've heard you're a striper. You hit quite a long way, didn't you? I can hit it far, yeah. yeah, yeah. And again, that's why the long irons are good for me. Like, I can I can hit them a good distance, but it's just these that I'll, I'll hit some great ones, mm. don't get me wrong, but yeah. my bad ones are bad. Yeah. yeah. Again, like probably most of the people watching. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I'm not going <laughs> to. There's some howlers in there it. somewhere, right? Yeah, yeah. Love it, right. And then um, this is probably my most improved, I'd say, touch wood. Don't want to jinx it, but. The white Hot versus Seven. Part of my game, yeah. I just. Is that, is that a standard solid. fit as well? Or yeah, I, I got it. I got it fitted, and oh, you I got found it fitted, it, right. that was the most interesting. But you think with the putter, you like, what makes a difference here? It's, yeah, it shouldn't be too much. But um, what did they? What do they suggest? What do they change when you got it fitted? Are you, you you're more upright? Are you more? Are yeah, you more angled? Is the, it lighter, sharp? The angles it? are all the same. I just, yeah. it just feels so much more balanced when I'm taking it back. It feels like I'm not just going here. I've, I've not got to fight it a little bit. So it's a bit heavier at the bottom. So it just helps gravity. Are you right hand above left hand? Just yeah, I've just noticed yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, just there. Uh, You've been doing that for a while or? Yeah, I mean, I play around with it. I've, have, I've had some 
bad spells with my putter. Yeah. So I, I change a bit, but I've been like that for a while now. And I think you just got to put your work yeah. in with your putter, haven't you? Really? Exactly. Yeah. We're talking like Jimmy, you're about to go out with him, but yeah. he changes putters every other day. Yeah, yeah. It's crazy. And you but just got to your eye, right? Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah, and then I think just get to know something. And I've actually, this one I'm really happy with. Um, so just need to try Love and that. hopefully start draining a few. Right, let's, t let's talk about gizmos and balls. So what, um, yeah. what range, what range finder you got? Uh, I've got this Bushnell. Bushnell? Yeah. Bushnell Golf. It's on my second one of them. I lost one once, which is always Happens a lot, doesn't it? Can happen. Decent little number. And um, you've mentioned, just, bef just before we got going, your balls. Yeah, yeah. So we've you've got, you've got some custom well, balls, I've got, yeah, I've got cool. a bit of... I haven't seen one I yet, but I'm intrigued. between the, the Chrome Softs and then we've got these, as an England team, we... Uh, so the Pro Vs. Is that normally what you play with the Pro Vs? Get the Pro Vs, a bit, yeah. bit less spinny. And then... Um, and then they asked, what do you want in it? So I just got my nickname. Everyone calls me Popey. I don't know if we so. can say that. We get a close up again, but we've got Titleist 8. Any reason for the Titleist 8? Uh, it's Popey actually, it. you know what? It was the one mistake they made. It was supposed to be 80. My, my shirt number's shirt 80. Shirt number's, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you said they got it wrong. Titleist 8, 80. Yeah. Shirt number's 80, you mentioned. Yeah. What, why is it 80? Um, What's the story so behind that? So I'm actually, I'm 32 at Surrey, and that's yeah. just my favourite number. Just random. I don't know why. There seems to be a lot of 32s around the circuit though. Yeah. Um, and then someone had played for me with uh, the shirt number 32, so I couldn't choose 32. So I was an eight, I was 80 with the lines. I just, I actually think it looks better. Oh, okay. Pope 80 just got, it looks quite cool on the shirt. So I've just left it with that. Nothing, nothing with that too superstitious. Right. Okay. Yeah. Talking of superstitions, what have you got any like in golf and in cricket? Yeah, not really in golf. Cricket, I've got two probably. I always chew gum before I bat. I don't know why. I think I was told it relaxes you, but I've just stick with it now and I always chuck it in the bin on my way as down. well. Oh, so you're on the one way yeah, down? Yeah, yeah. I get too worried I'll swallow it or something and <laughs> make a fool out of myself. <laughs> Love that. And then my other one's just in between, just before I face each ball, I actually just smack each leg because it's like a reset. So. Have you always done that? I when, started, when started doing it that? when I started doing well for England. Right, so okay. and I just stuck with it. So I normally probably, our superstitions yeah, work, right? Yeah, if they yeah, work, yeah. you carry on doing yeah, them exactly. until they don't. Yeah. And it's just like a little reset. It's like you could play a horrible shot the ball before. Yeah. But then whether you're, I do it in the nets as well. So even when you're in the nets, it's just something that whether you're playing in what, front hard? of- hard? Like, no, is it, no, is it just like a, a sort feel. of like come it's on sort like, of thing? Yeah, yeah. Not, not even a come on, no. it's just a, so whether I'm in the nets at Surrey or just locally, or whether I'm playing in front of 50,000 people at, I don't know, somewhere in Australia in an Ashes test, it's just something that goes, right, we're just batting here. Oh, okay. It's just the same. Like I'm trying to complete the same skill. It's yeah, just, yeah, totally. Yeah. It's obviously matters a bit more, but. Oh, I love that. Yeah. All right, mate. Well, top man, thanks for that. Looking and forward. best of luck against Jimmy. Cheers, appreciate it. Hope you beat him. <laughs> Me too. Let's go.